Hi, how's it going guys? It's Siren here, and today we're here with some more Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, first things first, I can't quite remember what was been going on in the story. I think we had to see, um, went fishing in the last episode with Dutch and Hosea. Not really too sure why. <laughs> I think we just to spend some sort of time after we moved to camp. To try and get away from the O'Driscolls. Can, can I have a quick word? Yeah, sure, Molly. I'm not too sure who Molly is, but seems like she needs a word with us. So let's go and have a quick gander here and see what we can do for her. Yes, Miss O'Shea. Ah, call me Molly, would you? Oh. Arthur, how is Dutch? I mean, how does he seem to you? I'm about the same as usual, I guess. I, I really love him, you know. But if he, like he always says, loyalty is everything, so... Arthur! Excuse me, Miss O'Shea. What you want? I bring a gift. The great gift of information. So you got some tip off. So now I can yeah. risk my neck and make you some money while you lounge around. You know, Arthur, bitterness, it, it works on the inside as well as on your sour face. If you say so, <laughs> you could go find some other fool to run your errands. Bill, come on over here. Will you be my other fool? You too, Charles. What are you talking about? Arthur's above a little stick-up I heard about. No, I'm not. <laughs> you just said. Yeah, I'll do it. As long as you ride with us. Oh, I got a serious medical condition. <laughs> yes, you are a compulsive liar. Uh, no need to be like that. Charles, have I ever lied to you? I hardly know you. Exactly. Now, you boys should do this. It, it's easy, and I'll only take a small commission for my information. But it's now or never. Then it's never. Oh, God help me. Fine. I'll do it. <laughs> well, what is it? It's a supply wagon carrying payroll, but very briefly unguarded, apparently. As it passes through a crossroads near here where there's an old ruined church, before it connects... With the rest of the wagon train, very easy picking. As long as we get paid or you get shot, I'm happy. You are a sick man, Arthur Morgan. A very sick man indeed. Uh, it just seems like rolling out with the boys again, rolling out with yes. Bill and um, Charles. Smart Alex. And from the sounds of things, we've got some killing to do in this episode. Oh yeah, I've also been um helping out the law, I believe. Do us all a favor. Head home. Just give it a rest, you two. Just have a little faith for once, will you? I've been scoping jobs like this since you fellers were knee high to a grasshopper. Once a decade. Yeah, I think I've been helping out the law so that way since we've now moved to camp, we want to really lay low and get in good with the local law so that way. If some goes south, they would be less likely to either suspect us or hand us in. Okay, hold up here. We should cover our faces. They'll be passing through the crossroads up ahead. Oh, sweet. So we're not going too far then. Let me mask. Here's. Soon, Williamson. Christ's sake. I should be due any time now. Let's keep this quiet and clean. Nobody needs to die here. There! You see, gentlemen? <laughs> Just like clockwork. <laughs> Stop the wagon! <laughs> no fucks given. shot but this is a mistake i work for cornwall kerosene and tar uh, mr leviticus cornwall oh great so you know him who <laughs> doesn't i hear he's rich enough to share the wealth around and not miss it too much oh he'll miss it okay why don't you check out around the back arthur help me out here i'm checking the back it with charles it seems but we really want to be ripping off um, 
Cornwall again. After all, he's the one the main reason why we had to flee last camp. Sweet. Here we go. An escort. Let's go. Let's just kill him, man. I think we've got the manpower for this. I guess not. Got no choice but to flee. No. What the fuck do you think we're doing, man? It's got a bullet in the ass. Whoa, shit. Let's just kill him then. It's one way to get rid of them. There's only two of them. Fuck knows Bill. Are you sure? Because there's one right there. Got it, man. There's a barn there, we're hiding there. Alright, hide so what are we doing? Sweet. Get out of here. Get out of here, go on. I'll see you later. Alright. Just get out of sight. Stay until dark, and then we'll sneak out of here. Charles, you keep watch for now. Sure. Well, Your man's always getting us into trouble. Get some rest. Try and get out of here. Hey, shit. Absolutely. Well, shut up, old man. Well, look, I was just trying to... Shut up. There's a light over by the house. Damn. Hey, now let's just keep this calm. See what happens. Is this your place? Kinda. Uh, and you didn't hear nothing? I, why don't you just tell me, partner, what you heard? Hey, hey, tell me what you heard. I don't... I don't maybe I, I heard some noises out by the barn a while ago. It ain't me. Oh, it better not be. All right. Well, shit. Send, me, send them right to me. Go check out the, the barn. Sir. Ah, oh, crap. Fuck we're gonna do now. I right, getting a little bit suspicious, that's good. Please don't come inside. You head inside, shit. around the back. God damn it. Might still be good though if you stay low. Place looks empty to me. And the old guy up there is full of crap. I don't think they're here. Don't see any horses. Come on, let's head back. Boss! Place is empty! Shit! Oh, come on, Bill. Looks like we're shooting our way out. 
Ah, oh, let's wait a few seconds longer. We'll be out of here by now. Um, no. No, we're not. Oh, there's no one here. Oh, shit, the bed. I'm trying to, but the bone's not working. There we go. I want you to find out who you're robbing before we rob them, yeah? Do not let them close in on us. Fucking pillar keeps getting in the way. Oh, I need to relocate because this um, pillar's getting so annoying. Ah oh, man, my aim is terrible. Ah, oh, I need a better gun. Yeah, let's hide out for a split second. Actually let my health heal here before I actually face bite some dirt. Now oh, I saw a gunshot here. There's someone still on the side and quite close as well. Oh, fucking hell. Woo! Nice shot. What side? Ah, oh, shit, we're on fire. No, you didn't. No. We're burning alive. Oh. That's a bit of bollocks. Sort of could have a cutscene and they get shot in the air. Or because... Or was it literally because, um... The thing fell on me. Oh well. Either way, I've got to do this again. I, I literally just go and look at it and look at it. Uh, skin, let's escape quickly. Come on, Bill. Yes, please. Let's get the fuck out of here. Because we are heavily at man and our guns. Go samurai style. Use the woods as cover and actually just shoot them down one by one. Hide in the mist. Sounds like you're dying, Uncle. Ah. Can I swap swap you with Bill?
How the hell did you not see me, man? Oh shit! Get the hell off me, Arthur! Got a wife at home? I'll go make a call. Quietly, man. I'm trying to pick up my gun at the minute. I'm kind of noobing out. There we go. Guess we should go give him a hand. Oh shit, they are when to attack. I was wondering where this gunfire was coming from. Oh, they're quite close. It's not too bad. Okay, that's the end. That's our ally. Okay, I see where they're shooting. Well, get behind cover then, and it won't. <laughs> Nearly got a bullet to the face. Fuck you, Bill. Split up, go on, run quick. Good luck, Jens. Stay quiet and move. Yeah, this is this is not gonna go well for us. This is literally deja vu all over again. And yeah. I have a feeling Dutch is gonna be a little bit pissed with us. Alright, where next? Uh we've got Lenny. Lenny needs to speak to you. That is a great description for the next mission. Or we can View Gray. Oh, him. Penelope. Uh, Brave White. I never pronounced that correctly. Requested that you deliver her letter to him. Oh, yeah. Have we not done that yet? I thought we did that ages ago. Huh. Clearly not. Okay, then. So it seems like we can either help Lenny or this bloke. Not really too sure which one I'm going to be doing. But I'm just going to cut straight there. So I'll see you guys in a couple of minutes. Alright guys, I just thought just for um, time purposes sake, I would go towards the mission with Lenny. Um, I believe this is him now, walking to... Oh no, that's that thing that's him there on the ledge. Who's that then? Is that Butch? A Dutch rather. Oh no, it's Javier. Or John. I don't know. Yo. You got a lot on? What's on your mind, kid? Uh, just hunting for all this hillbilly gold that Dutch and Hosea seem to think is out there just waiting to be stolen. <laughs> Why? I got something. Could be good. Yeah? Yeah, I was in Rhodes talking to some of the colored folk. They said there's a gang of fools holed up in the swamps east of here who think their war ain't never ended. The Civil War? Yeah, apparently it's still raging in these fools' minds 30 years later. Okay. That ain't my point. These ignorant fools are weapon dealers. And in their dealings, sometimes sit on a decent pile of cash. Yeah, been selling weapons to Cuba and South America for years. Anyway. Why do you look so different? To, reckon there might be a bunch of cash just sitting around. And failing that, maybe a nice stash of weapons. It's just a bunch of crazies, Gardner? Exactly. Well, worth taking a look at least, isn't it? That was my thinking. Said it was at some place called Shady Bell, deep in the woods. OK. 
Okay. <laughs> hmm. Might just be me, because I might have just be looking at it completely wrong, but Lenny does not look like the same character. But as I said, I ain't played this game in a little while, so it might just be me seeing things that aren't actually there. That's right, so my horse is on the right, that's fair enough. Tally Ho. Didn't still need to name my horse, I think. Now tell me about this plan, man. How are we going to go about this? How are we going to get these weapons? these crazies before you've been drinking again no well yes but no that's not how i might have met them i think some of them harangued me and sadie when we were coming back with supplies mrs adler yeah and mrs adler did just fine more than fine actually oh, what's that crazy fine. crazy gang called well, I got um these we won't find no shortage of angry Peckerwood idiots in the state. Oh, I can't remember. That's for sure. Is it really that different in this state? We haven't come far. It seems like it is. These boys got a manner about them, but I haven't necessarily noticed. All respect, Mr. Morgan. You wouldn't notice. Might call you a nigger lover. They see us riding like this. But most of it is a... A glance or a word. And after that, a visit in the night. Well, out west, it's out west is out west. <laughs> and you're all who you are. Right. Decent folks. But some places down here, they judge different. Well, hell no. Guess it can't be so easy for you, Lenny. Sorry you're caught up in this. Well, I guess their gold's still shiny. And their guns still shoot. <laughs> so I'm game for robbing any and every one of these bastards for all they got. <laughs> okay, then. Plus, it beats being lynched back in Blackwater with all of you by my side. I guess it does. Feels like we're close. It's a rundown old plantation house down in the bayou somewhere. Let's take it slow. Be cautious. If, like you say, these crazies are sitting on weapons, we're gonna want to strategize a little before getting shot at. <laughs> of course. They said find the old battlefield and keep on going. Well, we got some wrecked old Civil War weaponry. Now where are the wrecked old Civil War holdouts? You see that church up ahead? They're supposed to use it as an outpost. Heard they got men going between here and the big house all day. Okay. Look at this field. <laughs> Imagine getting caught up in a fight like this. Yeah, I don't care to. Hold those reins in. Let's just take a look around the place. I hear you. Uh, it doesn't look like anyone's here. We don't know that. Well, sure. yeah, as they say, Let's have a they're military, aren't they? So they'll be keeping them, their um, location and identity is very hidden. Easy. So you probably won't know they're here until the very last minute. Hey, come on. I'll lead you there. Shut up, man. I'm looking at me paintings. Hear that? Someone's on the track. Well, they're getting louder, but I can't see him still. There. there he is. Let's see where he's going. You're on me now. Right behind you. Let's keep our distance. Just two fellers out on the road. Those crates in the back. They look like explosives to you. Good. Oh, beers. Worth a follow at least. Let's do it, man. I 
I think I see something. End of the avenue, between the trees. Might be it. Might be. Keep it steady. Hey, big plantation house. <laughs> Must be Shady Bear. I reckon we can leave our mounts up there, off the trail. Are you sure, man? Good enough to me. I got some sneaky sneakies to do. Ah, come on, Lenny. You slow bastard. Is your weapon scope? Okay. No. Nothing's happening at the minute. Sweet. I know dynamite crates when I see them. We got something, right? Oh, we got something. We can hit them head on, fight them honest. Or you could go down there acting friendly. Friendly? With these folks? Just draw them into one spot. Then I'll start shooting. Well, that might be the dumbest idea I've ever heard. But hey, I'm always up for a performance. Good. Off you go. You gonna make a call? I'll send you because I want that dynamite. I'll definitely get some money. Wouldn't try anything less. Uh, if you're going all, all the way to the house, um, I'm gonna be waiting here for a little while. Oh no, here we go. Discuss the merits of glory and interest you in eternity. <laughs> Praise be my people. Come on, kid. Now, uh, are you uh, happy? Will you be saved, my brother? Who the fuck's shooting here? Praise be. Huh? <laughs> Praise be. Nice headshot. Don't know if that's way too early or not, but I don't want to be sitting around for too long. Oh shit, there's a lot more of them. Even with a freaking sniper rifle, I can't even get hit. Okay, there's two in the house that so I can see. There's one just over this way. Can't quite see where he is though. Straight in the back. I wish that thing happened like all the time. That'd be quite decent. Just like Sniper Elite. Nice. Now just out of range for that one. Holy shit, where did you come from, man? Wow! That happened fucking fast. Oh, come on, man. <sighs> Fine, let's do this again. So why do we always seem to come to these missions with no backup? I think this mission would be going a lot more swimmingly if we actually had some sort of help, no? Uh, 
Oh, come on, man. Oh, fuck off. Oh, so I think I'm in a better position this time. I think I've killed the bloody asshole that keeps coming behind me just to kill me. Nice! Alright, pop your head out, man. Oh shit, there's a guy behind the thing. That's a horse, so I'm gonna shoot that thing. That's Lenny. Preferably don't want to kill him. Ah. Oh. Fuck me. My aim is terrible with this gun. They're all done. The music seems to have stopped. Quick. Any men in the area would have heard that. They might be on the way. Now let's grab something and get out. Sounds like a plan. Let's search these wagons, okay? Alright, let's do it, man. Hey, this could be promised. Dunno, can't get up. That's inside. Oh, there we go. Here. Come on. This is full of new rifles. We can sell those, right? We sure can. We'll check the rest later. Now, come on. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Get this back to camp. Yeah. You have to be an awkward bastard, couldn't you? Alright, let's get the hell out of here from what for more, more men show up. But that mission was quite annoying after a while. Don't spare the nag. Come on. Come on. G up. Fall in. <laughs> crack that whip. For fuck's sake. Trying to fuse. Doing some business with your brothers back there. You don't look like any kind of folk we deal with. Our business was conducted to the satisfaction of all parties. Until now, that is. Nope. No. Something don't feel right about this. Not him and not you neither, Yankee. Get these line bastards. Ah oh, shit, maybe it was basically asking to interrogate him. Then you have fucking time to move. Uh, I hate how far this always puts you behind. No, oh, fucking hell, Seal can't even have time to reply either. I right, fuck trying to fight, I just wanna fucking get the fuck out of here. I just want to fucking put this mission behind me now. Well, that's embarrassing. So, what were you talking about before? 
Sean's a loudmouth braggart. Don't worry about what Sean does. Hey, I like him, you know? Well, so do I. Guess my better judgment just... You worry about you. He wasn't on Leviticus Cornwall's train with me. We had to dig him out of Blackwater. But... That's not but nothing. Me and Dutch, and everyone who counts, we know what you do for this gang. We notice. Keep it up. You're gonna start seeing things change for you. Okay, then. Okay. Thank you, Arthur. What's going on? Are we near in the camp, or... Is something about to happen here? Because I don't know why it's just suddenly gone into cinematic mode. from me. Hey, I always enjoy riding with you, kid. <laughs> you know how to fight. Hey, you too. Anytime, Arthur. Well, that mission was at least tedious. Glad it's done. So I'm going to be end ending this episode here. And I will hopefully see you in the next one. Take care, guys.